Happy Saturday. We in the thing. Hey, y'all. We here, child. We here, Juicy Delicious Jesse. Sexy International. Hey, boo boo. Child, let's go ahead and set this here mood. Get this on party started. I don't plan to keep y'all long. Y'all know it's Saturday. Y'all know how this gonna go. But I'll go ahead and take my time if y'all want me to. Child, we ain't got too much of merch to talk about on tonight. You know, we got enough, child. Let me fix this deal. I want my good old maternity bra. Just in case somebody is watching, I want them to see what it's like to be a mother of a newborn. You know, things are still leaking. You out here trying to fight. Not a good look, sis. Not a good look, but people hold themselves in such high places. I'm, I'm a good mother. I'm a good mother. Well, you should have taught that new mother some things, child. Should have taught that new mother some things. Go ahead, get the smoke going, blowing, trumpets, eagle soaring. Libra by nature, hey, boo. Elise, Elise, send the love and light. Shout out to you. McCarty, McCarty, we up here, baby. We ain't here. We ain't here. Go ahead, tell a friend to tell a friend to bring a friend down all to good old Sin City. Baby. Cardita Smith, shout out to the whole school game, premium in the mix, people. John Holmes, Nomad 1D. Okay, I feel that when I hear that Nomad 1D, I ain't never got to be mad about nothing, baby. But I'm going to come 1D. Shout out to Kitty, we 0017. I come alone, I drink alone. Come on now. Woozy Music. Hey, Boo Boo. Definitely got some fire music. Y'all gonna have to check her out. Um, Magic So Safe. Hopefully I'm saying it correctly. If not, you know who you are. You know what I mean by it. For the Kid TV, we in the building. We in the building doing big things. On this here, good old afternoon, child. Hey, y'all. Get on in here. Get on in here. Here y'all go. Do not forget, stand smiling in the building. I can see how the time moves. I'm saying, I'm saying, baby, turn up OG Dub. There she go. There she go. You know the show don't get started unless OG Dub in the building. Let's go. Hey, make sure you holler at your neighbor in the comment section. Spread the love and positivity. Cause things about to heat a little bit up tonight. It's about to get a little hot. I got my stage and my white candle, as per usual. Gotta do what you gotta do, child. Stay protected around you, they be playing, girl. They be playing. I see somebody in the comments said something about um, Sesame Street on yesterday. Y'all in the wrong street, wrong city, wrong section, wrong area. Spiritual being, getting ready for a party, but I'm here supporting, blessings, love, and like to all. Shout out to you, baby. Go ahead, be careful. Do what you do, turn up. I ain't gonna hold you too long. I ain't gonna hold you too long. Yeah. I will not. I dare not. I could not. I shall not. New residents, welcome, welcome, welcome. Miss Pretty Plano. What's up, beautiful? Send it positive vibes. Always welcome to the city. Let's go. Yes, I watch you daily. Hey, everybody. Hey, do you boo boo? Hey, do you boo boo? Hey. Welcome to the city. Mm -hmm. Love you, A. Welcome back, Miss Pretty. Oh, there has been some last girl. I'm getting my attire together. This is really not a maternity party, y'all. I just look like this here through this, through this here, here. You know, I just thought it was. Yeah. Anyhow, um, there has been some lies brewing around, um, over there in the shadow areas and over here in the other shadow areas. Mocha seventy six sixty one. Chandra Taylor, hello to a real one. We'll real recognize real. So what's now real one? Real one, Chandra Taylor. Shout out to you, child. Shout out to you. Taylor, hmm. I know some Taylors. I know some Taylors, baby. I know some Taylors. I'm actually looking for a couple of Taylors. <clears throat> hmm. It's a little shade, shade. I'm going to catch y'all up to speed on it there. One day soon. But tonight, we are not gathered here for such an occasion to speak about the Taylors that I am speaking on. Child, let me get this so tired together, girl. I don't know what this going on, my girl. There we go. Let me scooch up a little bit. I don't need y'all to see all my rolls and folds, child. I've been over here eating good, child. Need to talk about somebody on D-R-U-G-S. Mm-mm. Marie Laveau. 
Girl, I know Marie not in here tonight. I know Marie is not in the city on no Saturday night. You supposed to be having work to do. Girl, look at Ty Love. Ty, where you been at, girl? They been looking for you. Hey, Ty. Hey, Ty. A real reader, might I add. A real seer, might I add. Worker of love and light, might I quote. Beautiful brown one. Hello, beautiful. Hello, beautiful. Hello, neighbor. Athena Washington, hello to you. Oh, yeah, baby. Hello, Sin. Hello. Coke. Hold up. Okay, bro. Boy, by love. Empress Eight Star, Sexy International, Stan Smiley. Oh, I talked to you already, Stan. That's dead. Well, I see your comment out. Oh, got a stroke. Coming out the Coke can. Mm, mm, mm. Girl, let me get it from my phone because I can't see all the comments. I be trying to see here to everybody, child. I don't want nobody to feel left out. And now, oh, girl, didn't hear me with a commercial. Hold on. Chingy's eyes. Chingy's eyes. Hey. Let me make sure I miss nobody. I ain't trying to hurt nobody. Brown, brown, brown. Brown, 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 brown. Diamonds and pearls. Hey, boo. I'm in a nail shop getting pampered, and they told me to tell you Sacramento, California, is the city gang. All right, Kelly. Hey, y'all. Hey, boo. Let me give you some love, baby. Hey. Oh, girl, well, I almost deleted somebody's comment, y'all. My bad. Oops. Oops. I did it again. I came with receipts. A time and time again. Sweet a deep deep. Girl, so even if you didn't get to watch my live from this morning, I hope you were very intrigued by the title. It was called, I don't know what it was called myself. Sometimes I surprise myself with the things that come out of these here pair of lips. Um, or it was called round one. Nika the Geeka versus Dope Fiend Tita. Nika the Geeka versus Dope Fiend Tita. Mm. You know, it's crazy. Um, for a while, they were calling me Crystal Meth and Uphill Popping Animal. You know, and sometimes in life, what you do to others definitely catch up to you, especially when you are not telling the truth. When you are not being real. <clears throat> It is so hard nowadays with social media, with wigs, with makeup, to decipher between what's real and what's not. And um, I think it's, it's crazy. But that's when I always say you have to use um, your spirit of discernment. You try the spirit by the spirit, by the spirit, spirit. You know, um, it's so easy to get caught up in BS and it's even harder to get out of it. As I always say, y'all, I have no idea what made these people think that it was okay to declare a war with me, child, and think that the war was going to end when they said it was going to end. We just getting started, child. Welcome to the city. Go ahead if you have not already took off those. Oh, baby, I am extra, child. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm just a little white in the light. Um, take off those shoes. Put them outside the door. Gumbo, yeah, yeah. Hey, we we going to roll, baby. My hot girl to your hot girl will sit and fight for you. My hot girl to your hot girl, I got a hot boy that's on fire. Talking about hot boy, hot girl, hot boy, hot girl, everywhere we go. If Quatita was a real reader, she'll know the real song. Sips Coca Cola. Um. Yes, go ahead and take them shoes off. We don't need no seatbelts. I'm prepared to cut up if need be. If y'all tuned in on yesterday, we had some people that called in, you know. Hold on. Let me, um, skeleton key vibes. Let me start this over because I don't think, let me see. One, two, three. There we go. I see, hold on. My, my mouth is not matching up what was coming out. I don't know. We made it get all slow and stuff. Y'all, I do not. I might have to go change bras, child. Oh, who is this texting my phone? Girl, what happened? Don't ask me what happened, baby. What's happening right now? Because I'm what happened. I don't even know what it is. 
What's happening right now? I'm going to go give me a jacket or something, baby. My good old um, maternity breastfeeding bra ain't sitting up right. I needed another bra so I could come up here and shake my um, it's a bag full of Percocets. It's a bag full of Percocets. Let's get it, baby. Tita over there percolating, baby. Girl, I don't know who that is texting us, girl. It's a 504 number, so it's somebody I know, obviously. But uh, I'm hitting them up when I get off here. Talking about what happened with something. So I don't know what happened with nothing, child. I'm I'm over here down in the city. You gonna have to um, they gonna have to um, they gonna have to get on the guest list. <laughs> they gotta get on the guest list. Yes, keep stepping on them, stand like we do at the second line. <laughs> Scorpio Phoenix, hey girl, look at the best one in the build. Okay, let me be good. The best one in the building, Lord. Me get my life together. I got a bag full of Percocet. City bounce and everywhere and all that. I don't know what kind of broccoli tea to be using, child. Cause um, baby, them things be hanging low to the floor, reaching the back of the elbow. And, and um, you know, when she don't have a brazier on, the next time we see her, the thing sitting up. No, that's what I'm talking about when I say how people um, we gotta use our spirit of discernment nowadays. Cause everything just so fake child just so fake but anyhow speaking about fake swinging low three chariot put them titties in a bra swing low sweet chariot tie them titties in a bow roll ho roll ho ho roll down the roll with them titties them gorilla titties Gorilla titties, roll them gorilla titties. Tonight it's the city we come in with receipts. Tonight I'm the honey we come in on receipts. Child, listen. Oh no, oh no, here we go. You didn't say excuse me. You don't just open the door and say excuse me. How can I help you, child? You go to your room. You go to your room. <sighs> Let me go ahead. Let's go with this child, child. Hold on. Y'all talk to my girls. I'll be right back. I'm up here. Get out of my room, God darn it. Don't come back no more. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Christmas lights. I don't need the Christmas lights shining to my and stuff, girl. Well, yeah, y'all. Cindy left you alone. Oh, girl, you done busting my room. Talking about some. I said, excuse me. No, you need to knock at the door and wait for the door to open. Knock and the door shall be open. So anyhow, let's go ahead again to this good old. Um, I, well, I can't even say it to you. I'm gonna just say um, Coke, Coca Cola at this time because um, um, this gotta be some drug infused lives that people are doing so child where do we start let me review my notes over here um i don't know what i'm gonna talk about first um well i guess i could start with the unlimited liar hey winnie bullard um the unlimited liar y'all know who i'm talking about was live girl in subway flipping over cards Here's one thing that I don't respect. I do not like subliminal messages. I do not like subliminals, period. I told y'all I have ADHD. Even though I can catch on real quick, my nerves just get bad, right? Why is that, Sin? Because if you know what you know, you got to stand on that though. If I'm talking about you, I'm going to talk to you. Example, uh, Marvelyn Cottle, I'm talking to you. Stan Smiley, I'm talking to you. Libra by Nature, I'm talking to you. And that's what it is. When you got to get up there, because I got my calls to be a child. Because I might have to do a little reading. I'm lying, y'all. But you got to get up there. Yeah, and uh, let's see what call this is. And, oh, look. The police is coming. Knight of Pentacles. This is definitely the police. The police is coming. Because when you do wrong to me, it'll come right back to you. Let me keep going. My, you all up in Subway, girl. You got his call be going on. You don't even need to be flashing calls all the part of these people and all that your girl did. Let's see. Let's see the bottom of the deck. Judgment. Girl, that's crazy. These calls coming up. This is crazy, y'all. I 
Y'all see me really playing with this here, but judgment. Like I said, justice will be served. I want charges on all your mother. That's crazy. Child, girl, go ahead, spirit. Go ahead, spirit. What else you got for me, baby? Let me stop. I ain't gonna play like that, child, please. Mm -mm. Forgive me, baby. Forgive me. Y'all know this is entertainment purposes only. Y'all sent me here to talk to these people. Don't come over here messing with me. Now. I was just playing. Um, that that's what I saw on um, the unlimited lie. Your hands are dear, baby. Um, unlimited lie. You was up in subway, girl, flick, flick, flipping them um them dusty cards. All the money people go to a restaurant, child, throwing subliminals at people. Now, here's the thing. We all know you're talking about uh, Tita, the dope thing. So we don't need you to get up there throwing subliminals. Excuse me, girl. That's the coke got me gone, baby. I'm mine. Got feeling in my chest. Percocet. I got a bag full of Percocet. Percocet. I got a bag. Woo, child, I'm going to run it to the ground. Where the man is? The man in the building tonight? The, the man, tell, uh, tell DJ act right, baby. I need a bounce straight. I let him let him know, uh, <clears throat> same way, no, her little bounce track. Because I'm, I'm about to do a song on that, baby. I'm, I'm taking that one. We're going to roll with that one. We're going we gonna to rock and roll, baby. We're going to rock and roll with that one. Um, anyhow, she up and stuff with flipping dust and particles and particle sipples all over the place. What was the music, girl? Yeah, before I talk about that. Percocets. I got a bag full of percocets. We got to get that together. She done messed up now. Um... I don't even want a video for it. I just want her up there shaking them fucking long things. She just look like this too. I want her up there shaking them things, girl, and shaking that bag from left to right like she just don't care. Percocets. I got a bag full of percocets. Child, I don't know where my damn Ziploc bags at. I was trying to hurry up and go running. Um, I try to go run and get a Ziploc bag, baby, but I don't have it. Mustatics, mistakes. I call them mistakes. Anyhow, um, so you know, I try to help her for the unlimited lie your last night, baby. Um, and she um I said I was gonna call this y'all, but I ain't call it. But anyway, um, stop, stop doing it. And again, you don't consult with those cards or consult with spirit with such negative energy. That's just not how it goes. But what do I know? I'm no reader. Um, it's me, Lily. Says, get a money up here so she can explain to Papa Cantaloupe. Well, keep in mind, what the hell can a money get up here and say when there are several videos of people saying, Oh, girl, Amani made those drinks. Oh, girl, Amani made those drinks. Even at the unlimited liar, um, uh, <laughs> um, even at the um, girl, I gotta start reading these comments. Y'all, it's crazy. The unlimited liar event, uh, that she had went to Amani was making drinks. We had I showed y'all the video with the lady came up there saying that she had uh went to an event and that it was uh, um, I should say Amani or Pam drugged me. I don't know which one of them it was, but one of them drugged me. But let's talk about this tale. So. It have not even been 24 hours. Gretchen Cam talk too much. Always stop. You you don't even have a house in this city. You out here visiting, renting an Airbnb. Um, so it ain't been 24 hours since the Black Magic panel has been up, child. And I'm here to tell y'all if y'all haven't heard of y'all stuff, you want to hear it first since this city, child. That Black Magic is falling apart already. People are already reporting that they are being that they are being scammed out of their money. What's supposed to be $4.99 for Per minute or whatever, um, people are having forty minute sessions. Um, two hundred dollars being taken off their card, fifty dollars is being taken off in advance, not being put back in the card. They're being charged for stuff that they don't even want to be charged for, or services that they never received. So today, she might be still on live. Uh, Tita the dope thing decided to get on line and do a Bible study, which I believe is hilarious. I'm like, where is Toddy with the tarot cards? Where's Terry Tidy? Tidy Terry. Probably out there sucking on somebody's carriage, child, but you ain't hear from me. Um, so um she does this Bible study. Um, oh, 
let's get into this first. So in the middle of the Bible study, this is what she's saying, child. It's just, it's crazy. I'm upset with the people that went over there and got a reading. Because I'm like, I told y'all, I forewarned you guys about this hill. The whole thing has been that she is a scammer. And everything else. Um, Tati probably didn't got the hell away from her, child. Um, let me go ahead and rummage through my file, my file cabinet real quick because I need to get this video. This, this, I don't like when people lie on me. I told y'all that time and time again. Especially, do not get on live on a video that I have screen recorded because I'm watching. As you guys are watching as well, Tita and a limited lion. And on Nika the Geeka, you guys are watching. Hey, Krishani. This is the proper bra that you need, baby. When you're trying to breastfeed, baby, this is the proper bra that you need, baby. Um, Don't lie when I can just go run through my file cabinet and pull it on up. But don't take my word for it. Hold on, let me put y'all on mute because y'all know I got to go through the file cabinet, make sure I got the right files, and I ain't trying to give them nothing away before we get started. So give me one second, y'all. Let's roll this beautiful bean footage. Let me come a little closer. I don't want to show it because they've been trying to report my channel, child. So I'm not going to show y'all the video. I'm going to just let y'all listen to the, um, the audio. Y'all know what I'm saying. I hate when people try to do my accent or even try to talk like me. That's only one person that I know that actually has the exact same voice as me. And we still, like, you know, we only sound the same over the phone. But anyhow, um, you not her and she not you. Don't try it, bitch. But anyway, um, I'm surprised she haven't started collecting money for Kentucky yet. Probably in the AM. She's going to do a lot about that tonight. She probably did it in that fucking Bible study. And child, let me tell you, the Bible study, she's another one. That's the fuck I forgot to say. That's the hell I forgot to say. She another one, child, that's out there throwing subliminal. She's doing this Bible study and is taking this Bible. It was John chapter 6, verse 6. I told y'all that I'm an ordained pastor. You got to know that I know my word from beginning to end. I might not exactly remember where to go find the shit at, but sin knows the word. You know what I'm saying? So she is taking these um, these scriptures and just bless, just doing blasphemy all together. If she wasn't a psychotic mental patient, and this is not shade, this is not allegations, allegedly, none of that. She was in a psychiatric ward. I got the paper. Work, baby. Somebody they got people that work in CPS. I got people that work in the mental section, sweetheart. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Talk about violating HIPAA laws. But um, I'll say those for a rainy day when I run out of content. You know. Anyhow, y'all y'all discuss me. Um, I got the hell I want to say, y'all. I always forget. Let me sip my coke. Maybe it'll come back. Oh. It came back. That's what I was saying. So she's trying to use. Oh, that's what I was saying. If she wasn't a mental patient, <laughs> girl, that's free. It's got to go. Oh, bring it back. <laughs> go bring it back. If she wasn't a mental patient, I would definitely say that she is the goddamn antichrist. She's the antichrist in a female version. Why would I say that? Because she took that that Bible. She took that word and definitely tried to portray it as if it was her. Not only that, it tickled me pink, baby. I'm talking about tickle me Elmo, me. The way that she tried to start talking about the devil they looked up the definition talking about the devil was the adversary and they gave the definition of an adversary and then tur turned around and tried to say that i was the devil bitch i work hard to be no motherfucking devil i'm just a person that i observed a lot and i get on here and i give y'all that of my opinion and a lot of motherfucking facts and that tita the dope fina is why you're mad that cold drink look good, baby. It is. Y'all know I don't even drink cold drinks. That's the funniest thing. That's why I be up here just belching away, child. Just like a whole pig up here. Look, that's all I drink all day, every day, child. Good old water. Good old water. But anyway, let's jump into these receipts, baby. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. I got a bag full of Percocets. Oh, no. I wish I could play it, but they go... They're not going to monetize the video. But anyway, let's jump into these receipts, child. This is from the Bible study today. So my chat line, my psychic hotline, for those people who thought you would call in and get a 30, 40-minute reading and then you would go then and um, dispute it with your bank.
and dispute it with your bank. Huh? Like she said, she sent over, not even woman enough to come in at the reading herself, she sent over for someone to get a reading from Red. Oh, hold on, my man. I'm up here trying to um, act like I'm a girl. And yeah. then at the end of her reading, she's going to spew accusations. Oh, I'm sorry. Let's pause and talk so, about it. So she's trying to um talk about her goddamn, um, what should we call it? Her scam line. It's not a hotline, baby. I know when that hotline bling. I know another scam about the ring. Somebody going to need a reading. My cash up go beat your ching and ching and ching and Stop it, Q Kelly. So you get a perk and a read. <laughs> you get a you get a perk and a reading. So anyway, um, she is saying that listen, child, she's talking about some I sent somebody to call in and get a reading. Y'all gotta stop giving me so much credit. Why the hell would I call get somebody to call in and get a reading? I would just call in and get a reading myself and record what happens and record record the scams. Like stop being so stupid but that's what happens when you're on those percocets i got a bag full of percocets my chat line my psychic hotline for those people look at them damn though they're gonna damn and at the end of her reading she's gonna spew accusations asking red me red to be exact she asked me red why why were you on the phone with Queen and Nika when they were on the phone with the hitman trying to kill Sin? First of all, Sin. First of all, that has absolutely nothing to do with me. Stop saying my name, putting my name and stuff that never happened. I honestly don't believe this. This is why I don't believe it. Why are the dogs is cutting up, y'all? Y'all hear them? Um, I don't believe it because I feel like had somebody done that, they would have called me, emailed me messaged me or whatever and reached out to me and told me about it i don't think that they would have just been trying to i guess help up for me or you know figure out if she's lying or not and not come back and send me the results y'all saying i'm paying people anyway wouldn't they would have came back and tried to collect the 200 as they you know went past school they definitely would have leveled up in my game monopoly but you know who am i so i never sent nobody over there i don't know what they're talking about I don't know what they're talking about. That's exactly what I feel like happened. Don't throw me in the middle of them. Now, I love, you know, if this did happen, I feel like this is why she's trying to now address these allegations. I, like I said, the the whole Bible study was about me, child. It was crazy. Hey, spiritual gangster. But um, let's run this back and just listen to the lies, okay? At the end of her reading, she's going to spew accusations, asking Red, me red to be exact she asked me red why were you on Cold the phone with queen and nika when they were on the phone with the hit man number one nika wasn't on the phone nika was on the phone with the hit man because it's her people but me red was not on that conversation me red was on the conversation where Fatita admitted it, that the same hit man was the same person that she got the drugs from and that they were on their way to houston to try to off me that is what happened i don't know why people lie and especially why would you get on social media and try to clean it up? But let's go. Trying to kill sin. First of all, sin is trying to kill sin. I don't need to try to kill sin. I have more important things to do, and that's a problem. She keeps calling my phone, which she ain't called in, in, a, in what, a few days? Huh? She got upset that I not answered her phone call. She called me three or four times. And so what did she do when I wouldn't call her? She texted and said, please call me. Call me with me red on the three-way. When I did not respond to that, this woman got on her platform and said, Queen has people shooting at me trying to kill me. Pause. That is not what happened. I, I just thought about it and remembered that I could show y'all the text messages. She's so stupid because if you watch this morning's episode called Round One, Nika the Geeka versus Dope Fiend Tita. I posted the receipts of that. I cannot show y'all my call log because Nika the Geeka played on my phone so much that that call log from that day has not been removed. That was on Tuesday and we are at Saturday. So I don't have that. I just hope that you guys can trust my word. If not, moving right along, y'all. I have no points to prove to nobody. I called her three times because she had just told someone 
that Nika the Geek and one of her family members were on their way to Houston to do something to try to do something to me. So my thing was, and then she was saying that, that we could apologize to each other and go our separate ways. My problem with that conversation is, if you felt like you were doing something righteous by telling this woman that and telling the lady to call and give me a heads up, you have my number. Why the fuck you didn't call me your goddamn self? Also, it was said that Mireille wanted to talk to me. And she was saying that she was afraid because she thought that I was a hothead and that I would not speak to her. I tell people all the time, I am pretty much the same person on here as I am in person or even, I'm girl, I'm turned up in person, but on the phone. I'm just a little bit more real because most of the time when I'm talk talking to people on the phone, I'm fucking busy. I'm doing shit. So I like to get straight to the point. Again, I have ADHD. I need you to get to the point. So my thing was, Quatita, do not send no fucking message that somebody's on their way to come do me something. You can fucking tell me that yourself. And then they were saying Amy Red wanted to talk to me, but she was afraid that I would be a hothead and would not listen to her. So my thing was, Tell me Red to fucking call me. We can do a fucking three-way and get this shit out the fucking way. Again, me Red, I don't believe that she has abilities. I'm pretty sure that she's just a bump on a fucking log. But I wanted to hear me Red get on that phone and fucking talk the way she did. Um, it's, it's so much that I want to tell y'all, but that's just pretty much the basis of it. So she's saying that because she did not respond to me, that I started... Um, Oh, Lord, I forgot the fuck she said already. Hold on, let's go back to her. Because I just get so mad when people lie on me. Like, what the fuck you just said, bitch? I wouldn't call her. She text and said, please call me. Call me with me red on the three-way. When I did not respond to that. Oh, that's a lie. Let me go back because I posted the receipts for that as well, child. Let me hear what she got to say. Then I'm, I'm going to tell y'all. I'm going to show you got on her platform and said, Queen has people shooting at me trying to kill me. I never said that she has people trying to um kill me. I never said that. I didn't say she had people not kill me, but I never said that she had people shooting at me. So that's a lie. And now you just pissed me the fuck off. So I'm not even gonna listen to the rest of it. But let's go to this here. Y'all told me yesterday to turn my brightness down. So let's see if we could um look at these good old messages today, child. I called her. She did respond to me. She said about someone I didn't respond. You did respond to me, bitch. She said that. She is in a session Tuesday at 5.04 p.m. I said, tell me Red, call me. Why am I telling me Red to call me? Because me Red said that she was afraid to talk to me because she thought I was a hothead. So I'm letting you know me Red can fucking call me. I called you again. You did not fucking answer. I called you again. And then I text and I said, or call me on three-way with her. So that we could just go ahead and get this shit out the way with every fucking body at one fucking time that is what happened i don't know why people think it's okay to fucking lie and don't implement me in your life you already implemented me in your motherfucking murder plot going wrong i don't like it one bit now i already told you i don't like people lying on me and it's like how much do you expect a person to take you got up there, you lied on me, told everybody I'm, I'm on drugs and I left my children by themselves and I called CPS on me and blah, 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 right? You drug my name for filth. Then you got on your own platform. She said out of her own mouth. This is not nothing that I made up. She said, you say you want band one sound, show me. You say you want band one sound and you love me. I got people texting and calling me all day, some of them, they love me and oh. Queen, this and that. Show me. Why is this bitch still talking? Why is she still alive? Why hasn't nobody walked her down yet? You say you want band one sound? Show me. That is what happened. So before I ever said that you was trying to hire a hitman to fucking do me something, I'm, I'm sorry, you weren't even trying to hire him because Nika bought him to you to use for free. You had got on your own platform soliciting for a hitman or a hit girl. So I'm going to need you to make it make sense. Don't say that I'm saying something that I never said. And don't backtrack on what you said or what you did when we have it on video. At one time, Q Kelly was deleting a lot of her videos. It would be real safe and real smart for her to start deleting videos again. 
Especially after we just seen that police card and that judgment card, child. But I'm no reader. You know. I just know what I know and I stand on it. <sighs> Let me rummage through my file cabinet, child. Let me pull up the other live. Oh, this was hilarious to me, child. So remember the lady that I was talking about that was in the tent? Matter of fact, let me show my video first. My video, I was talking about, it was a morning show, and I was talking about the lady who, from Whoville. I was showing her being drunk. Now, I had screen recorded the part of the video with the lady that's, that was in the tent or whatever. Because I wanted to put it at the end of the video, because I have the part with her cash check up there. So in my mind, once I finished destroying the bitch from Whoville, I wanted people to see this lady in my mind who is a victim of Q. Kelly. Because in the video, the lady was saying, I hope you real. I didn't took my kids out of school and everything else following you. I'm homeless following you. I would hope everything that you stand in your teachings are real. That is a bit on the video. You can go back and watch it yourself. So after I had destroyed Whoville, I put, I wanted to put the lady at the end of the video with the cash app posted because in my mind, she is a victim of Q Kelly and she doesn't realize it. However, who gives a fuck about that part when there are fucking kids living in a fucking tent? So I only screenshot the part with her screen recorded, the part with the fucking lady crying with her cash app so that my good old citizens of Sin City can help the lady. Fuck Q, Q Kelly. Fuck the fact that she's a follower of uh, Tita, the dope fina. Look at this lady. Look what she's going through. Let's put up some money for her. That was my goal. When I went back and looked at it today, I was like, wait, bitch, I did put it up there, but that's not, you know. First of all, I didn't even fucking talk about it. The whole video was about who bill. Anyhow, when I watched the video earlier, to my surprise, that part of the video was not at the end of the video. It was actually in the middle of the video. But don't take my word for it. It was no shade whatsoever. If any shade, it was some Q Kelly. I thought it was ironic that when the lady was telling you that she's done all this and her whole life was fucked up, as so many of us have, you know, fucked our lives up fucking with this bitch, that she's now homeless. Instead of Q Kelly saying, what is your cash app? Excuse me. I'm going to send something right now. She said, let me post your cash app. But y'all call her Queen Mother, y'all. So anyhow, this is a little snippet from my video. This is before I fucking bought up this thing about the lady. And I will show you after I talked about, I bought up that part about the lady. DJ, you sue me. What's down, baby? Let's go. Fine, right. But his daddy a gorilla. And the mama's an eagle. <laughs> that right, ain't the mama right. eagle. I said, hold on, bitch. <laughs> she got the jungle book. She got the whole She watched too much TV and she watched too much American Horror Story, too. Right, right. Because they didn't notice the combo. Because I don't give a fuck. Y'all need to feel me. Y'all need to feel my hurt. So maybe y'all let this woman do her work so we can elevate the fuck up out this shit. And I want to assume it's something that she did. Because she didn't tell me that she was doing that. She didn't tell me that. I want to assume it's like my grand, one of my grandparents. So, again, my bad on the editing part. That part was definitely supposed to be at the end of the video. That is how I wanted the video to end. Maybe that was one of them days I was tired and, you know, just kind of rushed through the video. But I'm showing y'all before I put the lady shit up there and after. The video was about who bill. That's what the video was about. So when you up there, hey, Ocean's Wave, hey, Nappy Roots Girl. Um, when you up there talking about that I was, matter of fact, this is what she said. People was pouring life into this woman. Queen, you're going to be all right, Miss Latasha. You're going to be all right. It's all right. This is your last day in it. She texted me a few days ago and said, I got, got the job. No, thanks to I her. I got the job. But all that devil could do was take that video and put it up to kill, steal, and destroy. Never mind that woman's children was in that video. They were not singing my praises. Huh? You hear that narcissistic behavior? The kids were in the video singing my praises. Who gives a fuck about you when they're in a fucking tent? All you cared about was that the kids was giving praises to you, but I'm a devil. All 
all you cared about was that the kids were singing praises to you. That's all you cared about. But I'm over here trying to post the fucking lady. I, I could have did a whole story on her, bitch. I still the fuck can. Stop playing with me, bitch. But that woman has taken that video to say, see, Queen is a devil. She made this woman leave her family. You did. Now she's in a tent. You did. I didn't say that, but you did. Never mind what that lady said her own story was. She said her story was she threw her life away for you, bitch. Never mind what that lady said her, her own story was. That's what the fuck the lady said. That is what the fuck the lady said. She threw her life away for you. You told them people put their kids out of school because if you uh matter of fact, I'ma drop the link early. I have time today because I seen somebody early. I couldn't address it when I dropped it just to keep feeling like they won't call in the day, child. I'm not um not with all this that we ain't ducking nothing today, child. Any of y'all won't call in. Don't don't hop in the comments and try to help off the Q Kelly. Call up here. Nico, we didn't tell your daughter out the frame. You could call up here too. Scary ass. Instead of having your fucking daughter call up here. You could call your pussy ass up here too. Y'all gotta um these hoes gotta stop fucking playing with me. For real, for real. They gotta stop playing with yourself. Um Q Kelly, you are a known liar. You are a known liar. For you to really sit up there and um spew those lies on me, you ought to be ashamed of yourself. For you to take that Bible and try to turn it into being about me. You got me fucked up. You antichrist wannabe bitch. Don't fucking play with me like that there. Hold on, I'm doing something, y'all. I don't know why people play with me, child. That, that's the wrong thing. That is the wrong thing. Where my girl is? Girl, y'all be changing these pictures up so much. Child, I be having to make sure I'm uh, sending the stuff to the right people. All right, <clears throat> this is our Bible study. Our blasphemy against the Holy Spirit, Mark chapter 3, verse 29. But he who blasphemies against the Holy Spirit um, never has forgiveness, but is subject to eternal condemnation. Hallelujah. Q. Kelly homeless with the lady with six kids. So how is she going to help her and she can't help herself make it make sense? Right. I definitely agree. Lord have mercy on, on her soul, child. On her soul. Um, so let's move right along because I told you I'm not gonna hold y'all. I tried to be on here for an hour. So let me try to talk fast, child. Um, Nika Mama, Miss Tammy, Mama Tammy, hey cousin Tammy. They were on here talking about oh, I, I went back and watched the video. When I'm over here talking, I can't hear that well. I'm sorry, I don't be giving a fuck to hear what is going on um on the other side especially when i'm arguing with someone so uh i told y'all last night i heard when she said that i call her grandmother every day i don't talk to your grandmother every day I, and i was like i said um i talk to her every other day but i, I only say that just to make her a little bit more mad a bitch and i need you to get your facts together don't come up here talking about what you think you know and you really don't do nothing so then um when i listened to it again today i heard her say a point of something i'm paying her a gg uh, for information Baby, Gigi money is long, child. Mama Tammy got money, child. Nika be around here stunting and trying to act like she got it because she want to be like a mama. She jealous of a mama, child, but that's not my business to tell. Mama Tammy, don't get on my line, curse me out tonight, child. Um, Mama Tammy, cash at me, child. Feel bad. Feel bad for me. Like, y'all don't get me started on this shit. Um, let this lady do her work. She gonna keep doing no work and fucking your life up. But um, anyhow, Mama Tammy has been riding fly, child. I don't know if uh how this went, but I ended up coming across Mama Tammy, baby. Just got her a brand new, brand new uh pearled out fit for a motherfucking queen. God damn it, um, uh, which my jiggle? 
Oh, girl. Why not? Let's see. So while y'all talk about, oh, I'm cash up and hoe for information. Mama Sam, I'm gonna need you to cash up me, baby. Welcome to the city. Are you a supporter or a victim? Um, I just wanna say, um, I think you're beautiful. Hello. That was all. Thank you. You know I'm married, right? I'm sorry. Hello. I'm sorry. I didn't know you was married. I think you teleported. I think you teleported, child. Um. I should have asked him, was he thirsty, right? I forgot to ask him, was he thirsty, girl? Where's my southern hospitality? So, while y'all talking about, right, I just seen that kind of, while y'all talking about Mama Tammy, let's not talk about how y'all on Section 8 and got apartments and cars with the CPN. But you ain't hear that for me. I heard it from, uh, Nika, when she was out there high, geeked up. We had a long ride. That's why I'm like, you keep you told me all your business. You told me all your business. And that's why her daughter's so mad. Especially when I posted them bitches or them girls that beat her behind. They got a, what the hell is this? A moth? What do they call them things? A moth? A moth? One of them things, girl. The girl, they didn't send the moth in my house, child. They didn't send the moth in my house. Right, she's such a healer. Not a TPN girl, a CPN. A CPN. She can't heal nothing. Because my daughter's sick. My daughter almost lost her life. Well, you ain't doing nothing to help it. But take a check every month. You inside it. But that has nothing to do with me, child. I'm just here just presenting facts. The bum was in the back seat listening please say it ain't so not illegal cpns the cpn child the cpn you know nika be talking about she got this she got this and she got that why your daughter don't have no car why your daughter don't have no baby daddy and i ain't even trying to victim shame i can't even say victim shame but she's learned so much from her pathetic mother so now she out here thinking that she, she just got it made in the shade child so well she could do people any old thing and ain't gonna happen so i told y'all that girl went took that um that birth control out her arm to get pregnant on purpose because the baby daddy CPN equals jail. Let's go run these cards, babe. Um, the baby daddy had um he had a baby already, got a little boy. So uh Nika daughter Christiane come in the picture, sitting up there trying to play mama to this little boy. They got um as Quasita would say, matching photos, matching clothes and the photos and our matching outfit photos. And that boy, baby mama ain't like that. She wasn't playing with that. Should I bring her to the show so she could tell her own story out? I'm going to let y'all hear from me first, child, because I feel like being messy is Saturday. Um, so she didn't like that. She got her baby, child. Because Shani was jealous. She wanted to make the girl even more mad. So she took the, she dropped out of school and everything, took the damn thing out of her arm, and um, went got pregnant. And now you thinking you done did something, and that boy living his life with his baby mama and his first baby, and you over there at your mama house, being messy, miserable, titties leaking, vagina still not even sealed back up like a vacuum, child. And you on everybody platform being messy. You over there, you and your mama having postpartum depression together. That's not a good look, sis. We ain't the same, baby. We are not the same. Now, now that I didn't told her out the frame, I need to go ahead and move on because I told y'all I ain't going to y'all too long. Again, uh, excuse me as I rummage through my uh, good old file cabinet, child. I want to show y'all this person. Let me know if y'all remember her. Does anybody remember this person? Does she look familiar to anyone, child? Anybody remember her? Or maybe you remember this here. Um, or maybe you might remember this here. All right. So... Or is it this one? I think I think y'all might remember this one a little bit better. 
because everybody had the same facial expression. Like, what the hell is this? What's going on, child? So let me just give y'all a, a little backstory. First of all, I'm going to be a, a, a woman. I want to apologize. I don't know if I want to apologize. I'm going to just go ahead and tell the truth. So this is what happened. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Y'all deleted the comment? No, let me see. Oh, no. All right. All right. Now, my child, I thought you were talking about me, girl. Anyhow, um, that lady name is Mel. Mel is a Nika supporter. From what Nika told me, excuse me, Mel is a millionaire. So this is what Nika told me, right? She said it. Um, she said, girl, do your subscribers be cash up you and stuff? I said, no, no, nah, really. I said, I don't really care about that. Keep in mind, this is a couple months ago, so don't nobody feel played. So I just cashed up you last night. Don't feel played, child. It's not, you know, blessings to y'all. Maybe return. I might return it to send up for one person in particular because um, the, the note that came along with it, damn it, got me choked out last night. But um, nevertheless, I she was like, well, I have two subscribers in particular. She was like, you got to reach out to your subscribers. Get cool with them. She said, girl, them people be having money. You know, my baby's got bills. We gonna run it up. My baby's got bills. Bag full of Percocets. Baby's got bills. Bag full of Percocets. Bag, 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 bag full of Percocets. So anyhow, y'all may be fan Nika Bills. Let me get these old ladies down, baby. Um, <laughs> not Waffle House. Hey, Keisha, girl. Um, so, uh, so two in particular, she told me about, she said that there's a boy, a man on that name, Desert Wolf or Desert something. So she have a, a, a jade necklace and a jade bracelet. And so she was telling me that she be tricking with that, child. You know, I ain't got to lie. Right hand, right hand for a baby. I ain't got to lie. Um, she tricks with Desert. And I was like, well, damn, this bitch supposed to be married. Then I found out later on that she not even married. Then I found out that he cheating on her. And so now she out there doing her. She like, well, fuck it. He doing him so now I can do me with bitch. I ain't got nothing to do with it, but I am all is, child. So she tricking with Desert. Desert giving everything. He be coming in town or whatever. Supposedly he got a nice car. They be riding around in the car, baby, with the bucket seats. Listen, listen, city on repeat. You feel me? So, um, that part is a lie. But <laughs> yeah, they be meeting up and all that, baby. Going chill at the studio. I don't even think he do music. I just think that they be there. But anyhow, so she be tricking with Desert. So then she tells me about the lady. Uh, oh, so this is how I know about this people because Desert put in money for us to go to this Ohio trip. Keep in mind, Sin originally did not have money. My husband cashed out me late on the night, but at this time, child did not um. Oh, girl, hey, you ain't husband. I don't be liking to talk to people, husbands, girl, especially when I'm telling you what I'm telling you right now, child. So I'm going to skip it. But shout out to y'all, baby. I love love, child. Love, 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 love. Let love love. Yeah. So anyway, um, so she tells me about Mel, the lady that I just showed y'all, the lady that called in last night. Not pubes. Not nasty pubes. Not, not nasty pubes. No. <laughs> A fan duo, Sexing International. I think that's what she's trying to say. Oh, we're just on FanDuel. I thought she said we are FanDuel. It's a sports betting and mobile casino. My bad. Never mind, love, Rika. Take my comment back from you. Um, Let me wrap this up. So anyway, uh, that's a paid for. So this she was telling me about Mel. I remember Mel because I had called. Nika asked me to call in her show one time. I did. And when I called in, she. Hold on, because I got to contact somebody when we get off it. Because y'all be, um, be thinking I be forgetting stuff. And I really don't even my head to daddy. No book comes to hand. So anyway, um, she was telling me, oh, so I called in her show one time. Mel ends up calling up there and Mel was telling me something, 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 which I agree with, but then something else happened to what a conversation was a little bit left. And we did not get into it, but I just was kind of telling her she was saying that child, I don't remember what the hell happened. But anyway, I just know that I was right, she was wrong, she was wrong, and I was right. But it wasn't a problem. You know what I'm saying? It, it just it was an agree to disagree situation. That was it. I had no hard feelings uh, for her. Again, I am a teacher. I understand when people make mistakes. I understand that a wise man knows he knows nothing. But he takes every opportunity to learn all that he can. Sometimes you shut the fuck up long enough, you might learn some shit. So, with that being said, um, you know, that was it. I thought nothing of him. So, as I'm on this trip, Nika is telling me about mail along with Desert. And these subscribers and this, you need to connect with them because someone be having money and they go send you cash, just PayPal, sales, and bank transactions. So she is telling me about Mel and she's telling me that Mel is a millionaire. Not only is Mel a millionaire, she's an alcoholic millionaire. She is depressed. She is telling me about how, you know, how people just have so much money, they don't know what to do with it. Or they obtain money from people dying and people leaving them stuff. And so they're even more depressed that they even have this money. They're happy to have it, but they're depressed about it. And basically, long story short, that, that's what happened with Mel. So she's telling me that Mel has sent money for this trip as well. 
And um, <laughs> y'all crazy. Um, so um, so we you know skip that part. Shout out the mail. Thank you. You know for pitching up for the trip. Um, on our way back to Dallas, she is telling me that Mel is texting her or calling her. One of the two, I can't remember. And um, saying that she's asking, you know, how's everything going? Are you okay? Blase, blase. And then she shows me the wedding dress. It is a red dress, look like uh, like lace, roses, things, you know, going on. I thought it was beautiful, just not a good wedding dress. But who the fuck am I? People do the fuck they want to do, bitch. At that time, I was like, bitch, I be there, oh, you know, whatever. So she's telling me that Mel is paying for the dress. She's telling me that Mel is a lick. Mel is just a dumb fucking person that just spends her money. Mel is a dub. Mel is just somebody that she fucks over. Mel is just somebody that she uses and abuses. Acts like she gives a fuck, but in reality, she doesn't. She tells me that Mel suffers with depression, and it's even worse. When she starts drinking, now she's calling Nika, texting Nika consistently, constantly trying to get attention because she needs somebody to talk to, and she's going to throw the money out like the people do when they call the scam hotline over there in the black magic sector. So, me, being a person I, I am, I am not a person that like people to use other people. Side note, when they talk about sin was a prostitute or whatever fuck the bitch said, I ain't never been no prostitute. I never had to fucking prostitute because I've always had my own fucking money. Whether I was broke today and rich tomorrow, I always had my own money. There was no need for me to go out there and have sex for money. Uh, everybody that have a story like that, I can't relate. You know, hopefully you live and you learn from that, but I've never, thankfully, had to do that. You know, I kind of, you know, had jobs. You know, if I had to work at Radish Checkers, McDonald's, Burger King, um, and wait on the next check in two weeks, that's just what the hell was going to happen. Um, I, I never had to have sex for money. So anyhow, long story short, I have, um, I'm a Pisces for the most part. I'm an emotional being. So I actually feel sorry for people. So in the spiritual community, they would say that you are an empath, right? I am kind of an empath and I feel bad for Mel at this point. Because, Nika, you don't give a fuck about this goddamn lady. She calling, she asking for help. And you just up there saying, ching, 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 bling, bling, bling. And this lady is paying for your wedding dress? Why isn't your boyfriend husband paying for your wedding dress? That's not cool. Why would you get her to do that? That's not right at all. That's not right. So... Mel, I'm not going to apologize for how I treated you last night because, again, you should have never spoke on me in that matter. I think that that is horrible. What I will say is I apologize that your eyes are not open and that you don't see the bullshit going on in and around you. Nika is not your friend. And I'm telling you this because I don't have your number to call you and tell you this here. I was not going to give you the time of day to get up here and help off for Nika yesterday, especially when I know what the fuck I know. Nika stole pills from her family member. Nika got with Potita to try to have this person take me out. They lied and said that I stole the pills, Mel. That's what I was trying to tell you last night. And as I tried to tell it to you, you will begin to get upset and say, no, 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 no. As if you knew the story firsthand. If you don't know something, as I tell my kids, you do not open up your mouth. My nose. Go blow your nose. I come to about your nose. Go blow it. You put my a, a nose wiper? No, I'm not. Go wipe your own nose and stop playing on me, child. Um, she's not your friend. She's never been your friend. And I would just recommend that the next conversation you have, it'll probably be her trying to tell you how much of a friend she is to you and how much she actually cares for you because she's trying to keep the money going, child. That is all she is trying to do. She's going to talk to you for a couple times just to act like she is your friend. And I'm just so genuine. And I love you from my heart chakra. You're in my heart. Stop that with that dough. You see me over here talking. Get out of my room. Go ahead. Come on. I'm talking. All right. Somebody bring me up. Give me a belt. Who that is? Mr. Lee. Throw me that belt, child. Yeah, they're going to give me a belt. They say you've been a horrible kid. So, um... Word of advice, Mel, like definitely watch the company that you keep. Watch who you did money out to because I honestly feel bad for you. And that, that's just not like it. If somebody's pretending to be my friend and, and they are, um, you know, you me up, I would definitely want somebody to tell me. 
What's up, um, F you Sumi? What's happening, baby? What's Welcome up? to City. What's, what's up, Sin City? What's going on? You what's better know, don't be whipping no, don't be whipping, don't be whipping nobody over there. <laughs> yo, I'm proud of you too, man. Keep going hard. Hold on. All right, time so. again. Yeah, yo, you ever uh, think about uh, starting a merch line with Teespring? No, I never thought about that. You know they said I was out here uh, messing with rainwater for for a damn clothing line in the record deal. Nah, you know, why I mean, are I heard, you suggesting I... that I should put on the sh on the shirt? Hey, anything you want, you could do, uh put you could do different things. Huh? You say anything you that fun? I want. Yeah, y'all. I don't want to say it on head, but you know what I'm saying? Right. <laughs> you feel me? Uh, nah, you know. You know what I mean? Because, uh, you know, some people be still not it's there. That shit. Yeah. But, yo, yeah. that's dope that you wrote a book. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Look at my baby, man. He said, man, you talking to a man. My baby. Yeah, man, I'm sorry, man. Child. But I got you. Thing. All right, no doubt. Thank you for calling in. Sorry, I'm not talking to a man. That's somebody in the show. Yo. Girl. I don't know, child. I told y'all I'm not going to hold y'all long at all, child. It is 8.04 p.m. I love y'all from a genuine spot in my heart for my heart chakras. Y'all need to leave this lady alone and let her do her work. Let that lady do her work so I can get a house, so I can get a perk. I can get a house, I can get a perk, baby. Hey, hey, it out. All right, be quiet. We're about to end the show. They down. I don't want them to see your face today. They're not going to see you. Yeah, shake up, baby. I smell new parts and do stay on that <laughs> Why y'all cut up so bad, child? Why y'all cut up so bad? It's 805. Shh. Hush, little baby. Before I break your jaw, child. Say run that beat. <laughs> I got a bag. Let me see if I can find me a bounce beat real quick, child. Come on, you gonna sing with me? I got a bag full of Percocets. Bag, bag. Oh, let me see. Hold on, let me run this first, y'all. No, rub my bag for me. Give me a massage. Oh, okay. While I find this here video. There you go. Oh, 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 oh. thank you, Pooh. So where my video is, child? Just sit, let me see. Oh yeah, this is good. Ah! Business, child. Oh, get, get up here. They told me hide my baby face, y'all. Hide the face. They said that people go try to come take you. All right. Anybody else trying to call it up here tonight, child? Go on once. Go on twice. Three, four, five. Come on. One, two, three, four, five. Four, four, five, five, six, six. Hey. What else? Yeah. Yes. No, what? <laughs> Seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, we good, y'all. We're going to go ahead and end the show. Tell the people good night. Say good night, y'all. Say good night. Get out the camera. Because we're going to wipe the goddamn nose. Wipe the nose. Oh, child. Oh, thank you, baby. Yeah, this they don't show my baby, girl. Don't worry about what I got. Go to your room. I've been growing my boy's locks since he was two, girl. He been having locks since he was two months, girl. We don't play around here, baby. We don't play. This this one of them night walk kids, right here. He a night walk kid. He a night walk. Kid. Night walk kid. Don't worry about what I got. Go to your own house. Go to your room. They don't even know about her kids. They don't know nothing. About
by them. But I be abusing them, child. I be leaving them at home by themselves. Look at this. You think I can leave them at home by themselves? Look how clingy. What is this? Turn your face. Turn your face before they get you. I'm going to let y'all go, though. Thank y'all so much for tuning in tonight, child. I love y'all so much. Go to Purple Heart stuff for the sarcoidosis research, baby. Um, This has been a great night. Very interesting. I told y'all I'm not going to hold y'all. I hope that y'all have a wonderful night, wonderful yeah. evening. I don't know if I'm dropping tomorrow um, in the morning or not, depending on the kind of tea I got. The, depending on what happens when I scrummage through this good old file cabinet of mine. You know what I'm saying? So, um, you know, we'll see what we can see. But if not, you already know. Put your hand up and dog on smoke. You already know that I will be here for 7 o'clock Central Time on tomorrow. Y'all meet me here. Be me here. And as always, welcome to Sin City. Real rap from Sin City rap. With real receipts and small settings. Not them big old long floppy things. Do your ears hang low? Do they wobble to the floor? Can you sit them on your lap? Could you make them things clap? Let me play this here. <laughs> what the hell wrong with you? Stop. Let me play this here as y'all uh, get ready to leave on out of the city. Now, Percocets. This is a bag full of Percocets, bitch. Percocets. This is a bag full of Percocets, bitch. Percocets. This is a bag full of Percocets, bitch. Percocets. This is a bag full of Percocets, bitch. <laughs> Get out of here. With that being said, one pill, one pound, walk him down. Walk him to... Look at him. No, you can't say that. Oh, Lord, I gotta go wash his mouth. I was so... Oh, no. Where's my sage, child? Y'all looking still burning, too. Give me your mouth. <clears throat> no. He said, is that Percocets? Mm -mm. I gotta go give him a spiritual bath. That's right. He gotta go get baptized. I got a donkey in the water. Y'all have a good night. I'm out this thing. This was fun. Much love to y'all. See y'all tomorrow.